creators, creating this type of card flip animation may seem impossible in Filmora, but it's actually super easy and fun. Want to learn how to create this animation? Keep watching. Before we begin, if you haven't already installed Wondershare Filmora, please visit the official website and download the latest version. Then install it on your computer. Also, remember to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon so you never miss any of our upcoming videos. Creating this animation is a fun process. You'll need two PNG images of cards and some cool effects from Filmora. Let's dive into the Filmora main interface together. First, head over to the Track Manager and add six video tracks. Next, place your first card image on track 3 and stretch it out to 10 seconds long. Feel free to change the scale to 80% to give it that perfect look. Now, let's add some flair. Go to the Effects section, find the Basic folder, and apply the Basic 3D effect to your card image. Great! At this point, let's position the playhead at the beginning of your timeline and tweak some settings. In the Effects settings, focus on the rotation and zoom keyframes. You'll want to set the rotation to 81 degrees and the zoom to negative 62. After 20 frames, adjust the zoom back to zero and change the rotation to 40 degrees. Easy peasy. After another 20 frames, let's bring the rotation down to zero degrees. Then after one second, go for a playful movement by adjusting the rotation to negative 50 degrees. Follow that up with a rotation of 50 degrees after another second. As we keep going, at the five second mark, Give it a bit of a twist by setting the rotation to 1,260 degrees. Then at the 7 second mark, switch it to 1,290 degrees. Almost there! Finally at the 9 second mark, bring it back down to 1,260 degrees. And after just 10 frames, let's add a little more excitement by changing the rotation to 1,450 degrees. Alright, let's take a look at our card rotation animation. To make it even smoother, we can use the keyframe graph editor. Just click on the diamond button to open it up. Once you're there, change the second keyframe to curve. Then switch the next one to continuous curve, and for the rest of your keyframes, go ahead and set them to curves. This should help your animation look fantastic. Enjoy tweaking it. Let's duplicate the card on the track above. Next, swap it out with the second card and use the flip option to give it a fun twist. Position the playhead where the card is about to turn, then split card 2 at that point and remove the starting part. Move a little further along and split the card image again, then trim away any extra bits you don't need. Feel free to repeat this process a few more times. Finally, don't forget to do the same at the end for a polished look. To make our animation even more exciting, let's add some fun effects. Start by heading over to the stickers section and search for fire particles. Next, grab the Logo Reveal Effect Element 20 for Track 1 and set it to 10 seconds long. Then look for Utopian World and apply Element 01 on Track 2. Don't forget to split it at 1 second and the 6th frame. Change the speed to 0.65 and make it 10 seconds long too. Lastly, search for Fire and add the Realistic Cinematic Effect Element 13. Add the Adjustment Layer on the top track and do the final color grading. Now, let's check out our final animation. Don't forget to render the project for smooth playback. It's that easy and simple to create flip animation in Filmora 14. Download or update your Filmora version from the link in the description and get your hands on these awesome features. If you found this helpful, give us a big thumbs up and share it with your fellow creators and editors. If you're interested in visual effects and tutorials, check out filmora.wondershare.com. See you in the next video.